hello to everyone who's scheduled to take uh, classes with me this fall 2022 semester. I want to spend just a few minutes talking about some of the general technologies that we're going to be using throughout the semester. And of course, we'll talk about this uh, in our face-to-face -face classes, but I think also it's good to uh, have uh, the video available so that you can easily go back if you need to uh, to review. Those of you who have had me in class uh, you'll see some slight changes in some of the technologies that we'll be using. Those of you who are just entering into the university, uh, this may uh, be the first time using some of these technologies. Regardless, if, um, if there are any questions at any point throughout the semester, if you have any issues about getting around the technologies, uh, make sure you're reaching out to me. So the first thing I want to share with you here today is basically the virtual classroom okay this is where we're going to have a lot of the course content in fact all of the course content that we're doing everything that we're uh, doing day to day can be found in the virtual classroom the activities the assignments the forums any of the uh, activities that we do primarily will be referenced or will be included in the virtual classroom now we're also going to be using Microsoft Teams, those of you who have had me before, this will be familiar. So we'll set up a new space for our Microsoft Teams space. And primarily this space will be dedicated to uh, sharing files. If uh, we're working on certain documents and we're sharing those documents, uh, those will typically reside in Microsoft Teams. Now, of course, you can post your questions and um, we can correspond through uh, the, the forum feature, the, the publications feature in Microsoft Teams. But for most of the announcements and most of the information that I share with you will be posted here under announcements in the virtual classroom. So I'll be using more this space than maybe what I've done in the past with Microsoft Teams when I post messages to everyone this semester I'm going to be using the virtual classroom. So the announcements here, this is where I'll be sending out information to the whole group. And we have an open forum where you should also be able to ask questions and post to the whole group, much like what we've done in the past with Microsoft Teams. So we're going to be using these two forums in the virtual classroom to both handle announcements and uh, any open discussions that we need to have and again, I would recommend that if you do have questions, I would post those here to the open forum so that your classmates can also benefit from uh, receiving information or answers to your questions. Now, if you have questions uh, throughout the semester, there are different ways that you can reach out to me. Of course, you can ask your questions in class. You can come by my office or if need be, schedule time with me to discuss face-to-face any issues that you're having, or we can also schedule time online outside of class to address your issues. And this is the Meet Online. This is the uh, space that we'll use to have those online meetings outside of class as it's necessary. All right, so we have Microsoft Teams. We have our virtual classroom. The last piece of technology that I want to bring to your attention and something that I'll be using a lot is RimNote. Now, RimNote is going to be something that I am using to share information and content to everyone. But I think it's also important to uh, bring your attention to this technology so that you can also use it for your own uh, purpose, not only for our class, which we'll be getting into how to use it, but you might find it useful uh, in your other classes as well. And so I'm not going to go into a deep dive on RimNote at this point. We're going to be learning RimNote together throughout the semester as we get into uh, the course. But I would go ahead and create an account with RimNote and start looking around and start using it. And uh, I think you'll find it very useful in terms of helping you study for uh, not only the class that we're taking, but your other classes as well. So RimNote, Microsoft Teams, and the Virtual Classroom, primarily those are going to be the technologies that we'll be using. We may use some others depending on the type of activity, but these certainly are going to be the three 
primary types of technology that we'll be using throughout the semester. Again, all of your grades will be in the virtual classroom and course content. RimNote will be using for me to uh, basically my lesson planning and sharing with you each day what we'll, what we'll be doing. And uh, Microsoft Teams primarily for hosting documents and files that will complement what we're doing in class. So I look forward to getting started. And again, make sure you're reaching out to me if you do have any issues or questions uh, with the technology for this semester.